Hey everybody, welcome to the Black Republican Theory. I want to uh, actually go over something that I was, I've been researching, um, not only for law school, but for work. Um, it's the fact that Biden uh, has, you know, appointed new members to the Merit System Protection Board, the Merit System Protection Board. Now this is the federal board or commission it's supposed to be bipartisan. There are three members. They have you need two members, two of the three, in order to reach a quorum for them to handle membership business, whatever. And what that means is that when you believe that you've been discriminated against or passed over for something, um, you know, a, a grade step, whatever, in the federal service, federal, you know, civil service and and employees, etc you can file a complaint to the Merit System Protection Board for them to review your case and or make a complaint and adjudicate it. Now, that being said, according to govexec.com, govexec.com, there's no longer whistle protection status for those who report to the Merit System Protection Board. Now, there was a particular case where a guy um, it didn't uh, specify whether he was black or not, but he said that the people in his office, there were multiple black people in his office that were passed over for promotions. So he reported this to um, the, e the Merit System Protection Board and they said, oh, hey, not our problem. So then he reported it to the EEOC, they said, oh, hey, not our problem because it was being handled at another board. So what it essentially had was, or happened was a procedural issue as to why he got dismissed or his complaint got dismissed and why there is a, um, there's no longer protections based on this precedent that has been set for individuals that are federal employees making a, uh, a complaint about anything. It's not just race, because you gotta remember the things that are, um, the things that you can, you know, make a complaint for discrimination about are pretty much anything, as long as it's a recognized protected class under uh, the uh, 14th Amendment Equal Protection Clause. So that'll be things like um, race, sex, uh, gender, uh, sexual identity, I mean, sexual identity, um, or sex or, or other, uh, other identifiers, religion, pregnancy status, etc. So you can still actually, you know, you could file these complaints. And if you, you know, are classified as a whistleblower, uh, according to your office, you no longer have protection for that. Now the board is comprised of one Democrat, one Republican, both uh, appointed by Joe Biden, okay? Now, the board previously did not have a quorum for the longest time to handle commission business, the Merit System Protection Board, that is, in order to have to handle business because of congressional grandstanding under uh, President Trump. When he came in, he appointed someone, he appointed people, they had a quorum, they were able to handle business, uh, then halfway into his term, um, around 2018, 2019, um, that person's term or the previous people's terms actually expired. The people who would have been appointed by uh, President Obama actually. Um, so I, I believe there was one Obama uh, appointee, one Trump appointee. Um, they, uh, so they were able to handle business, but then one of their terms expired. So when Trump went to go nominate someone else, they could not reach a quorum to handle business because the Democratic controlled legislature refused to actually seat this person. So I'm gonna, uh, I'm looking at an instance right now where there is some potential uh, uh, discrimination happening. And, um, this is an employment law case. And, um, you know, what remedy does this person have? I'll hopefully provide a link to the article where I found this information uh, below or in the description box. 
and I welcome your comments. Please, you know, let me know if I, you know, if you degree, disagree with my assessment. But please like, share, comment, and subscribe. I love when my uh, viewers actually comment on my videos um, because that lets me know that somebody's actually watching them. Um, thank you so much.